and see in the place to be and see hi all and welcome at my channel that's me your author and see in the place to be <laughs> yeah today I got a crazy video um, this video is about my wash machine from Samsung and today I make it on and there I got an arrow it's written L E I so that means lie and this arrow means that somewhere is water mostly under there like you can see this looks very sexy I know <laughs> but yeah this is the big problem here um, that the wash machine is losing water somewhere and um, this wash machine has under there somewhere uh, we can say a sensor so when this sensor gets wet or full of water the machine stops so when the machine stops you can do nothing anymore really not you can do nothing when I say nothing then it's nothing um, wait I need to see if I can show you this again but I need to plug in again the power because um, yeah it was all off now so the machine has made de ding that means it's on right now and now it begins the error code is L E I and you can see you can do nothing more let me just disable my smartphone lights so and here you can see it better now this is the exactly uh, error code that I get or that you maybe have also and this happens just when somewhere the machine uh, yeah is full of water or yeah it's wet we can say I will show you the sensor right now the sensor in this case uh, it's there somewhere there under there is sitting the sensor and um, I will try to show you this from up here normally you should go under the machine and open the machine so I will not take my Mac light focus yes good so um, yes here's the sensor I hope you can see that so there are the cables for the sensor and the sensor is sitting a little bit more on the right side down but you can see the cable management there are the two blue cables and the two red cables um, these are the cables for the sensor and um, you should look um, if you have a problem like this what is the reason and that's why these sensors are great so uh, the arrow code L E I just means that somewhere is water coming out sometimes here on your washing machine uh, sometimes it's broken here sometimes the tubes are broken sometimes under there is something broken yeah in this case the problem is here guys in this case I found the problem I have just opened it here you can just press this down and you can just take this all out so I was doing it I was doing it like this just and then I have just a uh, look inside and I saw hmm it's a bit dirty this is okay this is just normally but then I have take a look there inside and then I saw something strange and this is we can say a tube uh, that looks a bit like it's not in the real position so sorry because it's hard for me to, uh, to uh, show you this but I will now I will now go down here with my hand and I will try I don't know if it will be possible to do this and I will try to move this guys so that you guys can see what is going on here so the problem I'm trying to show you this like that so problem is here see that 
Yes. Here's the problem. So the shitty tube is just out. I'm gonna now try to go inside with my hand and remove it. Yeah, here I am. You see? Here's my finger. <laughs> this fucking tube is out and you can see also the holder, this metal thing here, is out too. So this is just jump it out. This should sit exactly here inside. But this will be hard for me now to make this possible with just my finger. <coughs> but yeah, maybe, I don't know. Let's see. <laughs> it feels like a condom. Or whatever. No, it's not possible. I will need to take this shit out. Okay, guys. Um, wait just a second. I need to take my smartphone off. Uh, my smartphone off here. So... And here we go. Okay guys, uh, like you can see my fingers are totally black and dirty. Yeah, I know, normally I just make some PlayStation and computer videos. <laughs> but this video here, um, it's a must for me to do you this, because a lot of people has a wash machine at home, and someone you will have this problem and you don't know why, and you don't know what the hell is going on here, and maybe you will buy you a new machine uh, just of... of just because this small problem here, okay? And um, I can also um, explain you why this fucking tube is gonna out here. I can explain you after I have washed my hand. <laughs> I can explain you why this tube is jumped out. Um, the thing was, I have um, let my daughter um, wash here something and I think my daughter has just put too much clothes inside and when the wash machine is jumping like this when it's turning <laughs> wow 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 then this here yeah this moves too much you see how it moves okay and really this can move so much also on this side it can move so much that it has just um, yeah push we can say the tube out because uh, the tube can't go that easily out. You, you have this, these things here, you can, you can just press them and then you can take them out, you see. And just then you can push them out and, and also there it's, it's hard now to take it out, you see. Because they are just fixed grade and this are just some holders, you know, some springs or whatever it calls here, I don't know in English. But these are sh just some holders. And... Um, they are not that easy to get out. So that means that the machine had so much power that it has, um, yeah, push us the tube out. I'm gonna now uh, try to take this fucking shit out here. I, I need to take all this part here out. Um, you got here one screw and you got here one more. And then you are able somehow um, to take this shit out and when you take this out then you can put back the tube again you should clean all before and then you just put all back again and then this should be great I will now just check it out how you can take it off um, I will now just pause it because I need two hands and then I will show you later how I have uh, just take this out so guys I'm back with you now um, um, you need to take this shit out here and uh, you just can take this out if you have opened the screws here. One, two, three, four, I think it was four screws or just three. Yeah, three screws you got to open here. And it sits like that. And then you just go with your screw drill just under there. And you pull it up. You can see that. You go under there and you just pull it a bit up. Yeah, just like that. And here. And here. You do this on all four clips here, one, two, three, four, or five, just go under here, and then you can just um, put this on the front, just like that. You just do that on all, and later, when you have to do this, wait, come on, yeah. here, and um, later you got here, hidden, um, wait from the side here 
you got hidden one more screw here okay this screw here on this side see that here um, is this small screw here and this screw is holding you this shit and if you try to uh, too hard then you will break maybe something so that's why you will need just first to take this shit all out and then you just take the hidden screw here out and then you can just take this all out here you just take the tube also out and then you move this shit out here and I have now just also see the problem so wait the problem is here the tube sits here inside and there's the tube okay here's the tube you can see that it's totally dirty just take it out you can also open it here see that just yeah delock it or whatever it calls take this shit out here we should clean this all more water so just put the shit over there and the other thing like I can see here is um, this problem here um, it says here it's not great you can see that and um, it should be like that okay and I think with the time when uh, this big thing here is moving all the time you know when it's shaking 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 and when it's shaking too much then uh, this will with the time it will um, yeah damage you this stuff here so in this case here it's not damaged you can go here with a hot air gun uh, with the hot air gun you can go here and press this back together okay so guys one of my best friends Thomas will record for me <laughs> and here we go here I got the heat gun and uh, yeah just take the shit out here and uh, fix it uh, inside I have not uh, uh, clean it I don't care but here um, you should now heat it up 380 is maybe too much Hand speed down. Go about 300, fully okay. You can go also to 200, but 250, 300, it goes faster, you know. Take a screw drill, put it up here, not too much, you need to feel it. Here it goes back already. Sometimes you just need to heat it up, and then you just uh, yeah press it with your uh, sc screw drill, and you need to uh, stay like that as why it gets cold. Okay, now stay like that. And of course you guys need to take care that the machine is not shaking too much so um, if you have too much closes or too much uh, yeah too much inside the machine um, it will shake too much so this machine here is about seven kilograms and you need to take care that you don't put too much otherwise this will shake too much also and that's of course not great so guys I'm now on the back like you can see I have just uh, talked this shit out here this is the back plate we can say I just have to take it out and then you can see into the machine we are now uh, back on the machine and here is the sensor and you can see this it's all full of water <laughs> so um, there's uh, we can say no wonder why this shit is all like that just look at this shit right okay so there's no wonder that this sensor has say stop and now um, just suck this water out however you do this guys and otherwise the machine will not work you need to take all this water out uh -uh. and um, yeah otherwise this will never ever work again 
you will need to wait about one month <laughs> or two months uh, that this water goes along. No, pro this is yeah. Look at this. Okay, just yeah. Very very ugly. Okay, guys. Uh, this was from me now. I'm gonna uh, dry this all. I'm gonna fix this all. And yeah, this is how you should go over here. Like I told, here's the sensor. <laughs> Full of water. And yeah, that's why you had problems here. So guys, before I forget, I have now just um, put the machine just like that a little bit. So that the water can go uh, on the back. And I have just taken again some towels, I have uh, just cleaned it all, I have now just plugged in the power cable like you can see, and here we go, this works perfectly. Okay guys, so normally this will now make bing, 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 with this arrow code L-E-I. Okay guys, this was from me, like I told, and see the place to be, hee <laughs> hee, with the wash machine <laughs> See you guys, peace. And see in the place to be and see.